Understanding roaring drunk, a phrase in the English language. Hello everyone, today, we're going to dive into the interesting phrase, roaring drunk. This expression is quite colorful and is used in English to describe a certain level of intoxication. We'll explore its meaning, origin, and how to use it in conversation. So, let's get started and unravel the mystery behind, Roaring Drunk. Roaring Drunk is an idiomatic phrase in English. When someone is, Roaring Drunk, it means they are extremely intoxicated or heavily under the influence of alcohol. The word, Roaring, here is key, as it implies a loud, unrestrained, and intense state. It's important to understand that this phrase is often used to depict a level of drunkenness where the person might be very loud, boisterous, and possibly out of control. The origin of roaring drunk is quite interesting. The term roar has been associated with loud, intense sounds. Historically, the addition of roaring to drunk enhanced the description emphasizing a wild, noisy, and uncontrolled state of drunkenness. It paints a vivid picture of someone who is not just drunk, but overwhelmingly so, often attracting attention due to their loud and boisterous behavior. When using the phrase, roaring drunk, in conversation, it's usually in a casual or informal context. It's not a phrase you would likely use in formal situations. Here are a few examples. 1. After the party last night, he was roaring drunk and couldn't even walk straight. 2. I've never seen her that way before. She was absolutely roaring drunk. Remember, while it's useful to understand and use idiomatic phrases like this, it's also important to use them in the right context and be aware of the impression they may give. I hope this video has been enlightening and has expanded your understanding of the phrase, roaring drunk. Remember, idioms like this add color and depth to our language, making conversations more vivid and expressive. Thanks for watching, and stay tuned for more interesting explorations into the English language.